If you're someone working in an office, you'll know that trying to align your schedule, calls, and meetings with your fellow colleagues might be a little challenging, even more so if they're from a branch office or perhaps even overseas. In short, teleconferencing isn't as easy as it sounds. But today, with the help of ASUS and Google, we'll try and make things simple for you. And it all starts with this. With the Google Meet Hardware Kit from ASUS, you do get quite a few things. First and foremost, you get the system itself, which is powered by an Intel Core i7-8550U, 4GB of RAM, and 128GB SSD. Next, you do also get a camera, and it's a pretty special one at that, with a 150 degrees ultra-wide angle lens. And it also features a 4K sensor, which allows you to do lossless digital zoom. Now, of course, arguably the most important in a teleconferencing kit are the speakers and microphones. This is able to output sound in a full 360 degrees up to 20 feet and also features active echo cancellation and background noise management. Lastly, you do also get a touchscreen control panel, which allows you to easily access all the features provided by Google Meet. Now, you might be thinking, there are quite a lot of things on hand, but trust me, setting it all up is pretty simple. To start off, place your system in an easy to reach location and near a main display you would want to use. Next, you have to use a display cable of your choice, be it HDMI or DisplayPort via Type-C to connect the system to your main display. Once you have that done, plug in all the relevant accessories to the USB ports on the rear and the AC power for the system itself. For now, we have a total of three items, the camera, the speaker mic and the touch control panel. Everything is provided, so grab those cables and connect all your devices to the system. But if you are unsure of what to do, always refer to the manual. Once you have everything connected, it's time to place all the devices in the right places. Our suggestion is to place the system and the touch panel side by side, at the end of the table or at the center. As for the camera, it would be ideal if you can clip it at the top of the main display. But be warned, the included cable isn't that long, so you might need an extension. Lastly, the speaker mic should be placed in the middle of the table. Now that you have the entire system in place, it's really easy from here on out. You just have to turn it on, connect to your Wi-Fi, log into your Gmail account, and you're off to the races. So what's the benefit of going with such a system? We would say three things. Ease of use, assured video and audio quality, scalable. Firstly, it's honestly really easy to use. If you're familiar with how Google Meet works on a desktop or a smartphone, this this is exactly the same. You can even use the included HDMI input on the touch control panel to connect the laptop to present what you have on hand with the present now function. Secondly, with the included camera and the mic, you can be rest assured that the video and audio quality of those present in the room will definitely be standardized. Lag lesser video and shorty mics will no longer be an issue. Lastly, with what we have right here, it can be considered a simple setup, yet it can accommodate up to 8 people in a small to medium-sized room, like we are in right now. But if you want to go bigger, that's actually pretty simple to do. All you have to do is to grab more speaker mics, and you can actually daisy-chain them up to 5. And with all 5 of them, you can now accommodate up to 20 people in a large room. It's that simple. So that was the Google Meet Hardware Kit from ASUS. Honestly speaking, if you're looking to simplify all your teleconferencing needs within a single package, this is something worth checking out.